The Wetland Center of Excellence program is about connecting secondary school students to nature and to wetlands by getting them involved in hands-on action projects in their local environment. The students get involved in projects that supplement their in-class curriculum. So they might do things like trail creation, nest box installation and monitoring, plantings, annual cleanups, dock constructions, and other stewardship projects that improve the local wetland site. We also encourage students to speak up for wetlands and the environment by sharing their stories, their experiences, why they care about wetlands with their communities, local elected officials, through Ducks Unlimited Canada's events, and also through mentored wetland field trips for local elementary students. I was leading the critter dipping activity, so the grade fours came and they were able to come up to the water and they got samples of water and were able to identify the critters that they found. I think they loved it. I know uh, most of our tour groups were so excited. They were crowding around the observation table. They were going crazy. They were asking a billion questions. It was a lot of fun. Did you see him? Yeah, he's really, really small. Can you guys try to figure out what that guy is? I've been doing walking tours. So we've been taking the kids around and showing them deer scat and deer tracks and all the different kinds of plants and animals we've been seeing. We've been using binoculars to find birds. We've been talking to them about the trees we planted, bird boxes, all kinds of cool stuff like that. My favorite part of the program is probably getting to watch kids get curious and ask questions because to me it's really fulfilling to see kids get out there and want to learn more. The Ducks Unlimited program for the kids is all designed so that they can have plenty of fun while they're at their day here, but it's mostly educational. So we use games like the water cycle game to describe how we get water from the clouds to the rivers. And we use games like critter dipping to help them understand how many different creatures live in one certain area and how important it is to reserve those areas. So throughout the year we've been having trips here. We've also been having workshops in school. We've been learning about why the wetlands are important, what kinds of things live here, how wetlands help fight climate change, all sorts of things. And now we're basically just passing on everything we know to the Great Forest. This program really helps to develop a lot of their knowledge of uh, wetland ecology and just different watershed issues and natural systems and how they work. It also builds all kinds of important skills like communication skills. This whole day has been fantastic. The students have been working hard leading up to it and it's really about how they apply their understanding and connect with other people and share their knowledge in engaging ways with students. So when I was in grade four we came on this trip and it was actually a really cool trip. I learned a lot of cool facts about nature. It kind of sparked my interest a bit and then now that I'm in grade 10 I got to show these kids all the different things that the grade 10 showed me when I was in grade four and it's just, it's a really cool circle. It's a great program because the kids get to come out and a lot of them don't have any real experience with wetlands and so it's cool to get to show them around, teach them about the environment and get them to have an understanding and not only an understanding but an appreciation for where we are.